Alright, today I'm going to show you how to take this plain old Coke bottle and make into this cool piece of art. I'm going to be using some magic marble paints with a gallon of water, dipping it in, covering this up with some green tape, let it dry, and then peel the sticker off, and there you go. Alright, so first things first, you got to drink the Coca Cola. And what you want to do is soak it in water to peel this label off. This label is actually painted on, but you want to soak this label in water to actually peel it off. So what I'll do is I'll let this soak for a couple hours, peel it off, make sure all the gunk's cleaned. Next, after we take off that label, we're going to take some of this green tape here and place them over the label. And I do four pieces of tape because then I can make sure I get the corners perfectly done. If you just do two, you may not get that 90 degree perfect. Now we're all taped up. Next to do is prime it. Instructions for the magic marble paints are fill up a bucket with cold water, you don't need any borax or anything like that, shake the paints well, mix the paints in, dip the object. So I'm going to take some red and black here. I'm going to start with red. I'll do a touch of black. And some white. A little bit more red. Pitch more black. I want to make sure I get the bottle covered fully, so I'm going to add just some more red here. It's key that you got enough in when you're doing a full object. Got a swizzle stick here, old straw. Just going to mix it together. Let's see, it keeps a little more red. Doing this is not an exact science, it's definitely going back and forth as you're doing it. I'm going to swirl these around again. I think we're all set. So we got the prime bottle. We're going to dip it in here slowly. Make sure you've got a stick to break up the paint. Move back and forth here. Turn it ever so slightly. Start to feel as you get a little bit further down, the bottle's really pushing on you. Take this, break up the paint. There we go. Pretty awesome. We'll let this dry. Overnight. Next thing you're going to do is you're going to take a razor blade and where you put the tape you're going to score right above it because you don't want to peel the tape off. So I'm just going to go right above where I placed the tape, 
do a cut line. And just grab from the corner. So there you go. That's how you swirl. You can go back now and clear coat this with like a enamel, clear enamel with gloss or semi-gloss. I'm actually just going to leave these. I'm not really going to be using them for anything. So I'm just going to put these up on my shelf and leave them. My black here needs to be thinned out a little bit. I'm going to call the rep and ask why it's splotting like that. Shouldn't be doing that. So that's how you swirl a Coca-Cola bottle.